We begin tonight with a story you will only see on Local 10, a man pleading for help after being shot. He crawled in pain to someone's front door, and the dramatic scene was recorded on the doorbell's ring camera. Let's get right to Local 10's Andrew Harris, live with the exclusive. Andrew. There's video, there's even audio of this entire encounter. This couple telling me they walked out of their front door never expecting there was going to be a crime scene on their front porch. He rings the doorbell, walks back, and falls to the ground. <sighs> Seconds later, the homeowner opens up, and this is what he hears. I've been shot. <laughs> I've been shot. <laughs> my huh? hand in my leg. Please tell me. I thought it was a joke, <laughs> but it wasn't. He was bleeding after one shit. He's checked everything out. Jeff Pigeon says his doorbell camera caught the whole ordeal. It happened around 8.30 Saturday night. His wife also comes to the door. They're right near Margate Elementary School and quickly realize this man drove to the area and got out realizing he needed help immediately. Kind of concerned. I didn't know what was going on, but the guy needed help. So that's what my first instinct was to help him out, get get some kind of medical attention. Hey, call, call 911. Call 911. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, hold on, buddy. We'll take care of it. You hear the man crying in the background as Pigeon tries to keep him calm. In a matter of minutes, police and fire rescue show up, sending that man to the hospital and trying to figure out how he ended up here. So back out here live, still a pretty bizarre case. Still so many unanswered questions. Margate police investigating here. The area was roped off Saturday night for a while. We know that a car was even towed from the scene. That victim is expected to be okay. The homeowner telling us all he overheard after everything had happened was the man telling authorities that he came into town from North Carolina to visit his children. We'll keep you posted. That's the latest out here in Margate. I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News.